Hi, YouTube family. I have waited to um, post uh, some visions I've had because um, they're just um, almost like a sci-fi movie. And it's difficult for me because I'm... Uh, The end times, um, the Bible talks about that in the end it's going to be worse than any time mankind has ever seen. And it is. It is. And I've had some visions and I'm just going to explain the visions. And you can, um, with the Holy Spirit, uh, puts on your heart, maybe you can comment. Um, on them. I, uh, the first vision is, I, I kind of drew little pictures, so I wish it would help. The first vision here, let me show you if I can, is this is underwater. These are little um, vehicles that go underwater. This is a huge drill bit. It's drilling down into this big area down here. And down in here, uh, there were these little peoples in these little round circles. Um, and there was like serpent tails and things like that. I could see swirled around it. And they were drilling and drilling. It was underwater. And um, this drill was here and this would help move the rocks. It would shoot things out and help kind of move boulders and things. And uh, so it's interesting that these were underwater crafts and they were kind of square looking. That's why they're, they look like that. Then, um, next in the vision is the actual, um, bottom part where I saw this still these circular things with little black people in them. And, um, there was this, this golden cage. Um, and it would look like a golden cage. It didn't, and it had things in it. Um, and then I saw wings and something laying down, um, just sprawled out. And I saw dragon tail and things like that. And I, that was above where this, this thing is drilling. It just gave me a closer look, a different way to look at it. And then it, um, the, um, uh, I'm missing a page here. My goodness sakes. Where they were drilling looked like this on top. And it was... It will go down this huge drill. It will go straight down, and this was the drill here. And it would push down, and there were giant lizards and things trying to jump out. And there was actually a man being dropped down from the top here. And these were now these are actual tunnels, and this is pushed back. Okay, which I don't have a very clear vision of, but it pushes pushes back. So this is behind me and then it's dropping down into a tunnel. I mean down into a waterfall. Like, I mean it's dropping down into this hole. So they had tunneled in and then dropped down. And so they tunneled in and they dropped down to this. Okay. And then this is the ring inside where they're drilling. And so they're drilling this and I see um, actually they, they uh, are drilling it and they're getting down further and they let this man down on it and that's before these little these little creatures start crawling up and they let him down on it and he's got to fix something these things are actually he doesn't see them they're kind of out of the way and the, the, of course he gets out of his little thing and he um is in a really strange suit it's um and this is underwater and uh it's a square very big square face on it, um, like like this. The the face thing is really really wide, and 
he can see far in it and he's got a big round hat on and you know his arms are really big and he gets out and he's walking he's he's kind of floating around and uh, he goes down and he's working on something down here with down in the bottom and then his he hooks himself to this winch thing and it's going to pull him back up well as it's pulling him back up these things just like um he gets something loose and this thing drops down and this winch goes up and and they eat him right there and uh, that was the beginning of of the fun and there was a uh i guess you could say there was a area up here where people were watching kind of like it was like a um an area where they had like bigger machines that they had already drilled holes in and it was much higher and it, it was um i don't know how they were up there but they were up there and so after he got eaten and this thing drops down um it drops down and once it drops down now the tunnels it goes down like this and it drops all the way down and now these tunnels all you see is this string in the middle just the string this is this middle string here and um the drill part and the rest of the big cone thing has broken through and dropped into a bottomless whatever and once that happens these things start going up those um those tunnels these tunnels they start heading up them they start going up the tunnels and they're like oh, okay well we're gonna go up these tunnels and we're gonna go up into the water supply or wherever this is i don't know where it is but that's where they're going and they're large and they're scary looking and they're not something we see here on on this part of earth and um then at that time these little these are little in all of the there's this sphere in the middle and that happens to be this thing and this starts shooting up through the center the sphere and it shoots up and it's shooting up right through the center of this this where the cone was and as it as everything clears as those lizards run down these things shoot this thing is shooting up and as it's shooting up you can see these black holes that's where those little black people were that are scurrying up the side and when they scurry up the side hold on when they scurry up the side they look like um that they're uh wispy like they're wispy people, they're wispy little people there. They're, um, they've got these wispy things all around them. And then they're people and they're like black and purple and they're, um, they climb up things. And then, um, I saw them on this, uh, kind of man made or whatever made, um, sea serpent. And they were all rowing it, and each in the in the the big spines that come off the back. That's what they used to row it with, and that made it move. And it wasn't real; it was fake. And that's how they moved along the water. And it was like their little boat, but it wasn't little; it was huge. And they could also swim, and um, they could go up on the ceilings, up on on everything. They were just, and they looked like almost like smoke at first. So. Then this cage opens, and I see the cage. Oops, hold on a minute. I don't need to move my phone back on track here. Then the cage, this cage right here, it opens, and I see um, like golden angels or something flying out of it. And I think, are these angels flying out of this cage and flying out because they um, were held there? Or are they the fallen angels? Or what are they? Um, they just flew out. And this cage was kind of like a cage. Like if you, if you saw um, a lightsaber, it was like it was made with that kind of glowing golden light around it. 
and um, I guess that held him in there. Um, and then I saw a dragon climbing up the side, a huge dragon, and then I saw a bigger angel, and he just flew up to the top. And as this thing went up, as this obelisk looking thing, and it looked kind of like an obelisk, which is interesting that all of, uh, there's so many obelisks in the United States and around the world. It, as it goes up, it goes up past the um, clouds. Here's the clouds. And it goes high, 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 and it's really long. And it's, um, but it's not long enough to touch the ground, but it's floating and it's, it can move around uh, just like it is. It just moves around just like this, wherever it wants to go. And up in the top that um, is sitting on top, that angel, that black. He wasn't black though. He was, he had, he had light on him, but in the center he was dark and then a dark purple and a dark black surrounded him. Like he was black, but his wings, but he had a, a golden outside. Like he, he could turn himself light. So, um, and then his little dragon, which isn't little by any means. Um, there's a huge sea serpent in the water. Um, there's stories about sea serpents, but when this thing comes up, I don't know if this is off the coast of California. I don't know if it's in California, but as this thing comes up, it's like an atomic bomb goes off down there and this huge, huge wave starts billowing up, um, as this, all the stuff comes up and, as it's coming up, this thing is coming out of a big trench here in California. And I know there's a big trench there, but it's coming out of a big trench there. And um, it just drags itself across and takes out all of the land there. And I have a, uh, another vision where I saw a big area swiped out of the land, um, and I thought it was a lava flow that came down. And uh, on California, all of the, the buildings were wiped out because of this particular thing. Um, but it still had this deep swatch going up the middle of it and that was made from this, this thing. And uh, this thing is long, 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 long. And I think it only has two legs, but it, it drags its tail and its body through the, like a, like a big um, snake serpent kind of thing and it has a very 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 long face like really long um so uh that's kind of what it looks like and uh, as the waves come so the wave will crash and it'll take off part of california and it just like a squeegee and it just wipes everything out and then another wave will crash over the next one because there's nothing stopping it, and it'll just take everything off. And then another one goes over that, and it just takes everything off. Then another one goes over that, and it just takes everything off. And it just keeps going, and it just wipes out the coastline. Just wipes it out. Just takes us. It's like somebody took a big squeegee on a, a mirror and went whoosh, with it. And it's just um, shocking how it just grabs everything and just drags it out. Um, and, uh, that's all for that vision. The vision happened and then, um, that night I closed my eyes and I was praying and I saw another one and it picked up where the last one left off and overlapped it. And I saw, I saw from a different point of view and then I saw more things. And then, and then when I woke up in the morning, um, I w saw a vision and I was, it was, it was like it wouldn't end. And I woke up in the morning and I, I shut my eyes and, and then I saw a vision. And then in the afternoon, you know, I would shut my eyes and I would see a vision. I'd get really, really tired and I have to close my eyes and lay down and then I would see the vision. 
Um, this happened for a couple of days, and um, that's kind of how it was in the beginning when I first saw visions, and um, when they started rolling in like that, and it it's kind of, there's, there's a lot more going on um, to come that I've already uh, written down, but this is all I'm going to uh, post for today, and then I'll start with uh, the rest of of what I saw tomorrow. So comment on it, uh, what you think, and um, that's what I saw so far. Okay, bye. Thank you for for watching my channel and, and helping me um, dice, decipher these, these visions.